Hey, sweet things! How about I show you a real good time in our town? You lost me. <laughs> hey, viewers, I hope that you are having a good time right now. Welcome back, everyone, <laughs> to this totally innocent, non-sexual game. <laughs> whose main theme is love. Uh, this is Master Galien, babe. I uh, don't think you're his type. You're Galien? I think I'm going to faint. No, I know I'm going to faint. Can I get your autograph right here? Yeah. And that's how this episode gets started. Oh boy, we're off to we're off to a great start. They I, I was just also thinking, influence. I, I was just also just thinking like Nal's like Nal, everyone's Galian's type. <laughs> it, can, like I can imagine her going, "Can I get your autograph?" Mm. Anyway, look, I can be more kinky than most, but as long as you have at least one kink, I'm into it. Mm -hmm. Hey everyone, we were looking for interesting conversations, and we found one. I want to be a cat in my next life. So I can have an excuse for licking my butt in public. What great dialogue. Brilliant. This, this game is truly written by masterpieces. She's no, blocking no, no. your fucking way! Ruining this my is a speed, speed run! run. Get out of the run. way! Stupid RNG. This is why we kill NPCs. Now just make your way back to the white dragon town. Um, and while we're on the way there, uh, I just want to show my appreciation for galleon as a character like mm -hmm. he's really campy and he adds this wonderful like fantastic element like y you kind of get this feeling that everything is not that serious with him oh the fastest way to do this is to set an a uh, to set a specific move to galleon but mm -hmm. i want you to like experiment with him he's fun he's a fun person just charge through like galleon is level 99 oh okay because he's one of the heroes yeah uh just use one of his spells so uh, we could theoretically would have been a great time to grind uh if we eh. weren't doing the speed run yeah, it would theoretically have been there. So here's a bunch of spells, and I think you should probably take a look at them, because these are, like, hints on what's to come. They like the stuff Mia masters? Yeah, th these are these are things that you probably want to know about, like rock and roll. Like, think about it. Vein rock is a place... And roll, rock and roll, This is proof that Vein is a place of sex, drugs, and rock and roll. I am one-third of Vein! Of course, I'm talking about the sex drugs. Yeah, the sex drugs. There's only two things. <laughs> Damn. There, there are only two things in vain. There's sex, drugs, and rock and roll. Rock and, roll. <laughs> and then there's me, baby. <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> Magic. Tornado. Tornado flame. Oh, I actually really like the animation for this. <laughs> Whoop. <laughs> Is that All your, your favorite planets line? Get the do you have no idea how much I love classic Simpsons? I have... Did I tell this story on the on the this the stream? Uh, I don't think so. Okay, so like uh, back when like UP, right. UPN played old Simpsons like three times a day, I would like watch every episode. So like I knew um, Simpsons trivia so well that my friends once tr tr actually had the Simpsons like Jeopardy and didn't even bother, th attempted to challenge me to it, and I won like before the game like even got off. I just answered every question. Oh wow! Like, like they, they, they when I was like, "What was the name Krusty used when he was um, hiding incognito?" I'm like, "Rory Bellows." Wait, Rory B Bellows. <laughs> like, literally, that's the extent of how much I could like recite the, the each episode from memory. Holy crap! Uh, are you're like one of those people who can identify the Futurama episode based on the tagline at the start? Pretty close, yeah. Yeah. I mean, it, it, again, granted, this was like 15 years ago, so I haven't watched. I've actually, I'm actually rewatching Classic Simpsons right now for the first time in like 10 years, and it's been quite the trip down memory lane. Uh, but yeah, the, like that, that, that's why I, viewers probably noticed a lot of my quotes are just Simpsons quotes. Man, I'm glad. I feel like you're sharing your childhood uh, love while I'm sharing this childhood love. This I feel like this is something that I haven't revisited in 15 years that I'm like just quoting at you for productive reasons mm -hmm. right now. So, like, if you can do the same with Simpsons, like, go for I it. I probably couldn't even pick a favorite episode, and I could just start reciting random... If you feel like opening that chest, it's an antidote. My, okay, might as well. Might yeah, as well, the, I guess. Like, literally, I just told you not to do it, because the time to open the chest is, like, 0.5 seconds. So I'm like, that's... Worth it. Nitro, Which of these is the fastest? Nitro Decker. Thank you. Yes, I've looked They all got old... They all got long animations. 
Yes. Um, there's a couple times where I actually choose to run anyways because I don't like the animation time. Yeah. And because you have a... If you kill the enemies, you can fight directly afterwards. But if you run from them, you have a little bit of leeway afterwards. Mm -hmm. So in this area, I don't do that because uh, it's very hard to avoid. Yeah. If you want to open it. Like, even if you trigger confusion and whatever, I don't, like, care. Mm. You just gotta power through it. Um, going this way in the cave... Like, you had to trigger a lot of fights just to run when you were going here the first time. Mm -hmm. And at this point, it's... it's do you want to risk it? Risk running away? Or do you just want to kill him this way and have a sure thing? Yeah. Yeah. Here I go kill him again. Here I go kill him again. Um, so for story purposes, I always like to go to Alex's house and say hi to the mom and talk to Ramos's dad. Mm -hmm. And then visit Dine's monument. Mm -hmm. But that's not necessary for the speedrun. All you have to do is go to the uh, white we'll, dragon we'll cave. We'll do that we okay. want interesting conversation. Um... To be honest, the, the parents and the... Uh, no, no, let's just do it. I mean, after how much R Ramus talked about his dad... Yeah. Like, we need, we need to talk to him. Yes. Oh, and we I will ask to gather... Uh, that'll be next episode. Um, I'll ask to gather a bromide, even I though we... I honestly don't even remember where the exit is. I think oh, to so the right. You're, you're heading in the correct direction. Okay, okay, cool. Yeah, it's an S pattern, and now you're at the bottom of the uh, S. So originally, just I, was right. I was heading down, and I was like, I don't remember if this is correct or not. Oh, I thought you were trying to avoid the uh, the toadstool. No, but... I was trying to remember which way to go. Uh, yeah, you took that slightly slower path, but it was the same direction, so I didn't correct you. Okay, cool. Yeah. I believe that's the last enemy you actually need to fight. I hope so. Yeah. Ended out to ended out south, but you don't need it. Welcome back to Berg. Well, we're back, back at the start of the game. Go right here. You... It just we... there it goes. Third try bridge. Yeah. God, that was awful. <laughs> We come back and the town's just leveled from those kids who were just casting spells. <laughs> that would be perfect. Oh, oh man. Are those kids still casting? I actually want to talk to them. Yeah, let's let's check it out. It was like who I said we're going to destroy the town because they were just casting earthquake. Hey, guess what? I learned another magic spell. Shaka shaka boom. Uh, that was really cool, huh? Wow, I feel a rush of power. Can you say child prodigy? Galen, any any comment? No. Fuck kids. Alakazam! Hey, I cast a spell oh, to turn you change. into toads. You need your magic? Huh. What? I think you've been hanging around... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wow, Ooh, I'm surprised uh, that the dialogue doesn't change with Galeon around. Yeah. Galleon! <laughs> <laughs> Excellent. Okay. <sighs> yeah, I've never actually never checked that, so I was check, uh, curious. That's yeah, I, just, I just thought it was funny. Ra Ramus' dad is to the left, for the record, in the, oh, green, right, in the house with the green door. I, I just because I remember making that joke. I wanted to check left. up on him. I, I was really hoping they destroyed the town. <laughs> oh man, that would be great. Hey Alex, it's good to see you again. I suppose my lazy son's right behind you? Screw you, Dad. What? I can hear his voice now. <laughs> it's as though he's saying, I'm not gonna clean my room, Dad. Dad. Oh, he's saying some other excuse, lazy bum. He started a business in Ribia? I didn't know he had any talent at all. Oh well, he'll, uh, he'll give up soon enough and come crying back to me. I'm crying back to me. Just my son. Count on it! What a great father. He taught me everything I know. To, to trust no one. Mm -hmm. He yeah. taught, taught me... I taught him the ruthlessness of capitalism. <laughs> Alex. No. What are you doing back in the village so soon? Where's Ramus? Did he die? Did you have to... Were you stranded on an island together and have to eat him for sustenance? That's how I expected him to go. Yeah, honestly, that's that's why I let you hang, hang out with him for yeah. so long. I figured a situation like that would come up. Yeah. What? You're guiding Master Galeon across our island? Galeon, you <laughs> fuck! Oh my! Master G Galeon. Please forgive my ignorance. I did not recognize how you. How did you still get it wrong by slowing it down? <laughs> this is such a great honor. Uh, please have mercy on my son and shower him with the benefit of your wisdom, like teaching him the right way to say your name. Your son is already wise beyond his feeble, insignificant years. He reminds me so much of Dine. It's frightening, really. He has this roughly the, the intelligence of a corpse. This is the first he's mentioned of it. Yes. The way he just, yeah, the way he just never says anything, it's just like Dine's corpse. It reminds me so much of him. Oh my goodness. Is that Master Galeon with you, Alex? Galleon! I can't believe it. <laughs> Magic! <laughs> Galleon, it's an honor to meet one of the four heroes. Alex, you should have given me some sort of warning. My hair's a mess. No, it's just like, excuse me, me and Galen are going to go back to our room now. <laughs> oh. Oh. <laughs> In front of your parents? Yeah. Why, you uh... are wise beyond your <laughs> years. Oh, my. Where else do we need to go? Uh, just the monument. 
Um, so once again, the, I really this like... This monument or the Yeah, one? this one. I really like how campy and just like... You, you know exactly what's up with Ga a Galleon. This monument is... Pathetic! A feeble attempt to keep Dine's memory alive. It should be dead. Like him. You should just destroy it out of memory for him. Our world must stop dwelling on the relics of the past and look to the future. A future ruled by one stronger than a feeble dragon master. One who can unite the world with pure strength of will alone. That doesn't sound like a village Magic! speech. Magic! <laughs> that doesn't sound like a village spe speech, film speech at all. So, what do you think of the, about the Dungeons & Dragons movie? <laughs> Unre unrelated. Unrelated. But I, I thought that the villain in that, Jeremy Irons, mm. like his overacting and campiness really made that movie entertaining for me. Like, I still like watching it. Yeah, it's, it's still an enjoyable movie. Um, it's just... Fucking chainmail bikini. I, that makes me groan every time I see it. Oh. You're not gonna like the future of this game. I, I, I'm not surprised. Oh, let's see if you remember how to sneak through this dungeon. If you want, I could just either... Like... No, I think I remember. Sneak, sneak, sneak. I just don't remember which way I'm going. Oh, in that case, I'll, I'll give you directions. Uh, I, I actually thought you would remember the directions as well. Nope. Uh, run or fight, you can you can one-shot them with your normal allies, so fuck it. No. <laughs> the alien to do all the work. Take a look at this! <laughs> it's just like, hey, we're a bunch of little flies, we're the first dungeon, we're here to challenge you! Oh god, I level magic, level 99! I just thousand. wanted to look cool, you fucks! <laughs> Tough. Thank you. Down the stairs, left. S pattern. Keep going, keep staying in the blue pattern, go south. Right, okay, yeah, yeah. curves around. Mm -hmm. uh, there'll be a chance to go right, Go. keep going south until you can curve up in like a C pattern, no, and then you'll go up another steps. You're going to have to fight at least one more enemy, choose between crystals or or flies or really fucking anyone. The choice is yours. The choice is yours. I choose fucking everyone. <laughs> ah, you and then up. No, no, not, not oh, up there. Oh, it's down further. Keep, keep going down, you'll, uh, you'll go to the All right up. It's a C pattern. Right, right. I see. I see. Do you see what I see? No. Very explicitly, no. Do Never. you see an I see? I'm really thirsty. Give me my fucking ah, I fucking see. flies. I see you did not see that fly see. Mm, I don't care. <laughs> Good. I will become the dragon master. <laughs> That's my plan. You fell for the oldest trick in the book. Killing someone. <laughs> <laughs> I really thought you were going to say, you fell for the oldest trick in the book. Murder. <laughs> oh, yeah, that's the one. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Man, I'm going to have to spoil something before it happens just to have you prepared. Shit. I'm, I'm not looking forward to it. It's not like I spoiled anything at all with any of my hints. No, nope, not at all. Especially to you, viewers. Yeah. I'm sure you could have not picked up what I was laying down. Go to the right. Wait, the woman in the mask was Lamia? What? <laughs> what? <laughs> I, how could I have known? How could I have possibly foreseen South? South? I know, but the fly's in the way. Instead, I just got hit by this guy. Yeah. I was trying to go around the fly. I understood what you were doing, but you were fucked but it at failed. that point. Yes. You see, the problem was, you fucked up. Yeah. See, what you should have done was not fail. <laughs> that, that, that was your mistake. Yeah, you see, if you had just done that, everything would have been fine. Mm -hmm. And you, then if you, you just gotten, go down the stairs. If you had just gotten it right. Uh, this is the point where I choose to run from enemies instead, because there's going to be three charging at you, and you if you have that invulnerability after running instead, it, it saves me a little bit of time. But you could just kill them all. That would be that. I that think would... it would be faster. Well, because if Galeon doesn't run, whatever. If Galeon doesn't run, he won't die. Exactly. Peace out, bitches! Yeah. You fucked! Oh, Just really ca bad at running. Huh. You know, maybe it would have wow. been faster Luna to just Luna kill the worst. Usually, your level actually influences your running. I think you only have like a twenty percent chance of failing right now. You just—I don't believe you. <laughs> there we go. And now you just go south and go left until you see the three pillars of ice, and you go inside that door. Left. Yep, that's it. Now, before you continue, I recommend... 
So you know how you love Ramus, like like loved Ramus so as a character, right before he was brutally murdered in yep, front of you. He had a heart attack and died. Well, luckily Luna is about to open up a store. So would you mind removing all of her equipment? Gotcha. Gee, I'm so surprised. So, just all of it. Yeah. Give it to Null. Take off that robe. Oh my. Do I have to unequip it first? I usually is. What the fuck? Hang on. Yeah, I, I right. just. Yeah. It's not uh, full. No, anyway. it's not full. It's. I'm always I don't able know to give. What's it... happening there? Yeah, that, really that just. Uh, I would save if I were you. Okay, fine. Certain nothing spoiler or dramatic is totally going to happen. Yeah. Um. So yeah, let's talk Pork, about. Pork finally remember who Lun that Luna is Alfina. You have returned, Alex. And even stronger than when I last beheld you. He still looks like his While you were gone, I watched the movie Dungeons and Dragons. Mm -hmm. What a great film. Mm -hmm. Jeremy Irons. Really talented. Gal Leon! Did, did you voice Quark? I did. Okay. It's been many years since I last saw you. Fifteen, to be precise, Quark. Now you must die. Not. <laughs> Not since that dark day when dear Dragon Master died. You know. Died and everything. Ah, oh, yes. I remember all too well your disappointment. Yes, uh, Quack. I have a question to ask of you. This girl. The one they call Luna. Is she the child born that day? Who I threw in the trash and lost? Should I say something? I can't say anything. <laughs> if only I could say something. Well, or, well actually, I his fucking love his, your inner his, monologues. His, his face looks more shocked. I'm actually much more like, <gasps> Luna was a child. <laughs> Luna was a child. Dying existed. <laughs> yeah. Oh, it's all this time I thought he was just a legend. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> so Alex's face was all like shocked, and Luna's like just like. <laughs> like, this I imagine is... she's just, like, staring off into space, like, not even listening. What a like, pretty dragon tail. La, 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 la. <laughs> you know, I had to miss the Berg music concert on this bullshit. I wonder what <laughs> or, I'll have to do for the next time. it's, like, time. one of those jokes where you, like, go inside their head to see what they're thinking, and it's just, like, playing, like, the Spanish flag song. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. Or, I, I just want to see this. There once was a little Spanish thing. <laughs> <laughs> I just want to see this another. And the dramatic revelation is, for you, you are... Oh, I am your father. I'm sorry, I wasn't paying off. attention. What? Did you say that again? Yeah. Can you repeat <laughs> that? Truth is a dangerous thing to some, Galeon. Galleon! <laughs> if you knew the truth, perhaps it would set you free. Our world is on the verge of chaos, dear Quack. And I must know if the cause is what I suspect it to be. Magic! We need to know if we must find the other dragons, Rom and Nog. <laughs> Ah, Ramanag, which I believe is also a holiday. Mm -hmm. Tell me, Quack. Tell me the truth. I deserve to know. I can handle it. Magic. Well, you were the Dragon Master's best friend, Galen. Magic. Magic. If he trusted you with his life, I can trust you with the truth. Oh, uh, you done fucked up, Pork. <laughs> I'm going to just take a quick guess here. Uh... Galen kills Quark and kidnaps Luna. <laughs> yes! <laughs> Luna is the one. Stab. <laughs> That's all I needed to know. <laughs> <laughs> yes! Surely, you understand you why Dain kept this from you. Now, Galen. Well, and Galen, I, just, I can I'm, understand. I'm just like, Quark is like, Hmm, why did the music stop? Oh well. I'm sure I'm sure what I did. Sure, you understand good why Dine kept this from you. Galleon, you just G called G me G Shirley. G Galeon? Galeon? You got a Galeon, you there? You got a weird, evil, villainous look in your eyes. And the music stopped. <laughs> Galeon? Galeon? Best line. What are you talking about? My coming out party <laughs> can begin. Oh my god. <laughs> Send I love him. Clowns. Send in the clowns? That was the line of like, what the fuck? <laughs> Isn't that, don't you usually use that when you do something bad that you regret? 
What have you done, Galleon? He's, He's transformed into Mecha Galleon. Oh my god, he actually is. He used a cyborg stone. I'm sorry. He's Galleon, dear Quark. Magic Emperor Galleon. <laughs> you basically just said what you said. I love this man. Galleon, yes. Are you serious? <laughs> yes. Someday people may mourn this day, but my glorious rule can only begin with your enslavement. <laughs> that laugh, though. He's practiced that. Yeah. I'm so surprised. I'm shitting diamonds. <laughs> oh, if this if this place is just covered in diamonds after this. Oh, I love the lighting effects. Though. Ooh, that must have taken a long time. Ooh, the patterns on these too. Gotta catch them all. <laughs> <laughs> this looks sweet on a ring. Quark shall be the cornerstone of a new order. My world order. But... How'd you get up there? <laughs> Who shall Magic! Be my queen? Me? Wait, I wasn't listening. <laughs> what Quark? I'm sorry, were you saying something? Oh my god! <laughs> Oh, wait, you're cheering. G Gillian, don't take over the world. Gillian, no. Gillian, yes. <laughs> Gillian, yes. That's how we got up there. <laughs> <laughs> uh, again, I'm asking the relevant questions. <laughs> Luna! Alex! Luna! Alex! Luna! Alex! Luna! Rocky! Magic. Bullwinkle. Now I shall, he said some lines. Oh, whatever. Path of Destruction. <laughs> that sprite for... They're using the same sleeping sprite for them, so it's like... I guess I'll nap. He's got like his, he's got like his hands on his stomach, like... Oh, I'll just lie down on the floor. Well, I've been talking that after yeah. <laughs> That surprise sure took a lot out of me. I'm sure Luna will be fine. <sighs> Let me just get some... <laughs> quick five minutes. <laughs> oh, wow. We're gonna... It's the same sprite. Oh. Well... What happened? And we'll find out what happened next time. Bye, everybody. Bye. Galeon, yes. Galeon magic.